Shen Zhou found solace and sought a good life within tranquility, searching for comfort for his soul. Tranquility here is not a bland or tasteless calmness, it encompasses conflict, representing a balance of the soul achieved after resolving such discord. Shen Zhou's tranquil artistic style exudes a life philosophy that values the present moment, seeks to transcend historical turmoil, and aspires for a balance of spirit amidst worldly troubles. This subtle charm in Shen Zhou's art spills over from the sorrows of life. The scroll, Farewell at Jing Ko, created in 1497, depicts the farewell to his old friend Wu Quan as he journeyed north. Shen Zhou accompanied him all the way to Jing Ko. By this time, Shen Zhou was over 70, and Wu Quan had also passed the age of 60. The painting captures the emotional atmosphere of parting in old age, intertwining the sentiments of farewell with reflections on the passage of time. The artwork is rendered with cleanliness and tranquility, with restrained arrangements of scenery, calligraphy, and inscriptions. The expanse of the river, the calm waves, the high sky, the sparse leaves, and the farewell party boarding the boat, all contribute to a gentle parting. The inscribed poem includes the lines, Reunion feels distant as the years reveal our age, the longing and farewell grows as the journey lengthens. This captures the extended space in the painting, contrasting sharply with the restrained atmosphere of the scene. The external world is filled with the desolation of autumn, mirroring the internal desolation of the heart. Shen Zhou's painting is a meditation on the spirit of autumn, the autumn of years, the autumn of seasons, and the autumn of emotions. Ten years later, with Wu Quan having passed away, Shen Zhou revisited and reinscribed this painting, overwhelmed with emotion and accompanied by a poem. A flower still clings to the withering branch, while another has fallen to become mud, yet their fragrance endures as before. In this particular painting by Shen Zhou, the emphasis lies in the impromptu nature of the feelings captured, such works could be described as improvisational painting. Placed within the context of Chinese art history, this holds a special significance. Shen Zhou once stated, the essence of landscape painting is captured by the eyes, stored in the heart, and then expressed through the brush and ink. It all boils down to inspiration. This scroll was created under the lamplight, certainly a moment seized by inspiration. The word inspiration here encapsulates his direct experiences, vivid perceptions, and natural epiphanies, forming the crux of Shen Zhou's painting style and serving as the most crucial theoretical foundation for the entire Wu school of painting.